Welcome to our virtual celebration for the completion of the Commodore Schuler F. Heim Bridge. This is one of three iconic bridges that contribute to the movement of goods from the ports of Long Beach and Los Angeles to the mainland of Los Angeles County, throughout California and beyond. Hi everyone, David Kim here. I'm so excited to join you in celebrating a major milestone, the completion of the Schuler Heim Bridge. This is a bridge with a very long history. It opened way back in 1948. And over these past seven decades, the Schuler Heim has played a critically important role in serving the ports of LA and Long Beach. And I can think of no better symbol of the connection between infrastructure and the movement of essential goods than the new Schuler Heim Bridge. So I'm truly honored to commend everyone involved in delivering the Schuler Heim from the CTC to the ports of LA and Long Beach, from the US Coast Guard to FHWA, from the Coastal Commission to Caltrans, job well done by all. This is exactly the kind of investment that epitomizes California's leadership role when it comes to freight, infrastructure, and supply chain management. So congratulations on reaching the finish line on a major capital improvement that will keep Southern California and the nation moving forward for generations to come. Thank you. Hello, I'm Toks Omishakin, your Caltrans director. I'm happy to be here on this joyous occasion, the completion of the Schulheim Bridge. The bridge carries great significance. It's a valuable lifeline to the economy of the state of California and the United States. The extensive project is part of the department's seismic retrofit program. And it's the last bridge to be replaced in this important safety program. Many congratulations to all involved. It's an honor to recognize you and acknowledge the immense amount of work you've put in. To all our external partners, internal partners, everyone from the CTC to the California Transportation Agency and to Caltrans, a job very well done. Thank you. The original Heim Bridge was constructed as a vertical lift bridge by the United States Navy in 1948, crossing over the Cerritos Channel. By 2009, many factors began to plague the deteriorating, seismically deficient Heim Bridge. It had come to the end of its useful life and needed to be replaced. The new fixed height bridge is designed to meet current seismic standards with technology installed that constantly reads and sends new seismic activity to our engineers so that they may better support our bridge now and in the future. Congratulations to all Caltrans staff involved in the construction of the Schulerheim Bridge, the contractor MCM Construction, and to all our partners for a job well done. Thank you. My name is Congressman Alan Lowenthal. Today we are gathered to open this new bridge and also to rededicate it to the man it is named after, Commodore Schuyler Heim. At the bridge ribbon cutting in January of 1948, Commodore Heim called the bridge a magnificent example of engineering. And he said, I'm under no illusion that it stands as a monument to me, rather as a monument to Terminal Island and the twin harbors of Long Beach and Los Angeles, where it was my privilege to represent the United States Navy. Today, we are here to build on the legacy of Commodore Heim and the engineers that designed the original bridge. It is only fitting that a modern redesign of the original bridge should serve two of the most modern ports in the world. And just like Commodore Heim, the leadership of the ports of Long Beach and Los Angeles continue to push forward with projects like this that protect our nation, strengthen our economy, and address the needs of our community. Thank you. On behalf of the Port of Los Angeles, I would like to congratulate Caltrans on the opening of the new Schuler Heim Bridge. Being one of only three highway bridges that connects Terminal Island to the mainland, this bridge is a vital link carrying the nation's cargo to and from terminals within the ports of Los Angeles and Long Beach. This new, safer fixed bridge will enhance the efficient, secure movement of goods at the nation's largest port complex. To our partners at Caltrans, 
I would like to extend to Pearl Long Beach most sincere congratulations on your completion of the Commodore Schuyler Heim Bridge in the San Peter Bay Port Complex. And the port appreciates your diligence in pursuing this project and finishing it in the midst of a global pandemic. You are doing your part to help fuel the economy during this crisis. Trade moving through the port supports hundreds and thousands of jobs in the local region. And now thanks to your bridge, that trade moves a little faster. We are close to completion of the Gerald Desmond Bridge replacement project just next door, literally connected to your new bridge. With these two new bridges, we have built into this port complex a very high level of dependability. And we are immediately improving traffic flow through the harbor complex. On behalf of the Gerald Desmond Bridge Replacement Projects and WSP, I want to congratulate our Caltrans partners on the completion of the Commodore Schuyler Heim Bridge. Our two bridge projects literally worked side by side for years, and we have always appreciated the close collaboration with your team to ensure that traffic continued to flow smoothly throughout the area when we had detours. Your team has risen to a challenge of building a new bridge in the busiest port complex in the country. In the spirit of camaraderie, we at The Bridge Project, we tip our hats to you. You beat us to the finish line you know, just by a nose. The Alameda Corridor Transportation Authority is pleased to have had a role in the successful completion of the Commodore Schulerheim Bridge Replacement Project. The partnership between ACTA and Caltrans made it possible for this critical transportation project to improve the Southern California goods movement system. ACTA is proud to have been a part of this endeavor with Caltrans. This partnership proves, once again, that when agencies come together with a single purpose, we can accomplish much and improve people's lives. Hi, this is Patrick O'Donnell. I represent Long Beach, Signal Hill, San Pedro, and Catalina Island, and also the two ports up in Sacramento. And I just can't say how proud I am of Caltrans and the Port of Los Angeles for rebuilding the Schulerheim Bridge. Thank you for your efforts. Uh, I'm very proud of the work you've done, and I know our community is. So again, thank you for rebuilding this wonderful bridge and moving our port and our economy forward. I wanted to add my congratulations to the project teams. This is complicated projects and it really has taken a concerted effort led by Caltrans District 7 and the team John Belinsky. Uh, tip my hat to you and to Carrie Bowen, to Mike Miles, all of our District 7 uh, folks who played a role in this and also the Alameda Corridor Transportation Authority. Um, you know, it's, it's difficult to replace a bridge, but when you're trying to do it in the middle of an active port complex, I want to reach out and just say a big thank you to all of our supply chain partners for your patience as we work through this and just celebrate the role you've all played in our uh, combined success here. So to all of our teams, a great big heartfelt thank you. This is Hillary Norton and I am the chairwoman of the California Transportation Commission. And I'm pleased to be part virtually of the Schuler F. Heim Bridge ribbon cutting today. Congratulations to Caltrans and to the Alameda Corridor Transportation Authority and your staff for a fantastic job putting together a bridge reconstruction project that is gonna enhance freight and be a project that all of California will be proud of. Six, five,